up, YouTube? What you know, my name is Domino with the Zero, and welcome to episode 14 of our Pokemon White Domination. It has been a little bit, which was unplanned, but um, my vacation to the Pokemon Go Fest got the best of me and uh, resulted in me uh, taking a bit of a break. We're back now, and we're going to hopefully be going regular starting today, which should be Wednesday if all goes according to plan. We should have videos again. This series is Monday through Friday. Um, should, shouldn't should miss another day unless we have computer issues or something like that. Um, in the last episode, we battled our rivals uh, after leaving Castelia City. I kind of remember what happened. Um, they made an attempt at destroying our team. They were unsuccessful in doing so. In today's episode, we're going to be making our way towards Nimbasa City. So, if you're enjoying our Pokemon White Domination and you're excited that we're back, make sure you hit the thumbs up down below, make sure you're subscribed, and thank you so much for checking out our videos. The grind is on. Speaking of the grind, you should also check out Pokemon Conquest if you haven't already. That series goes up on Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday uh, in the evening time. And then check out our new series that should be starting today. That is our Pokemon Sun Wonderlock. I just got back from vacation, but we're about to go on vacation. You feel me? You feel me? Let's start off with a team recap, because I don't remember our team. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. First up, we have Bridget, our level 28 randomized fire type nine tails, holding the quick claw with the rash nature, with acid present, ominous wind, and protect, uh, and the poison heal ability. Next up, we have Katita, our starter, the level 28 ground type Magmortar, holding the Amulet Coin, Timid Nature, with Vacuum Wave Cut, Lava Plume, and Whirlwind, with the Dry Skin ability. And lastly, we have Emery, the Hacks God himself, our level 28 Pori uh, Psychic type Porygon 2, holding the Eviolite, Brave Nature, with Body Slam, Swift, Hurricane, and Roost, and the Rockhead ability. Now, if I remember correctly, we're, like, not supposed to gain any more levels, right? Per our own rules, we're supposed to not gain any levels. Whoa, is this how we're starting? I get back from vacation and we're starting with the controller doing its own tri doing its old tricks again. Alright, so we're going to explore all over this area. Um, we are going to battle... Let me see if I can find more encounters before we battle. I think that's what I'm going to try. Because we already found our encounter here and it was... Was this the Nidorina? No. The Nidorina was before. What did we encounter out here? I don't remember. I don't remember, but we encountered something out here. Anyway... Why did I do that? Like, you you just saw me run in front of this person. You saw me, like, intentionally run in front of this person for some unknown reason. What are these trainers Pokemon type levels? 21. I feel like we're getting so over-leveled, and I really don't know why. Um, probably just because, like, I only have three Pokemon that I can battle with. Um... Uh, but, I guess we'll, we'll do our darn thing today, um, and then tomorrow we'll hopefully have another encounter or two, uh, and we can take on more trainers. Lovely kiss. I don't feel like doing this sleep thing. Also, I've got to tune my mind back into the rules of this. Gyro Ball. Bridget, wake up! How's the Quick Claw gonna pop, but I'm not gonna wake up from sleep? What kind of sense does that make? Twice in a row. Bridget, wake up. I'm not healing you. Alright. Alright. Okay, hold on. Now I guess I will heal you because you're dumb and dying over here. That's one of my three heals. Again, I've got, I'm, I'm telling myself this stuff so I remember my rules. Let's go for... I guess I'm, I'm just going to keep spamming acid. 
And, you know, I, 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 I try to keep my, con I don't know why, but I try to keep my controller off screen. Because it just doesn't look professional. It doesn't look good to, well, speaking of not looking professional, uh, come on. If this thing uses rest again. If this thing uses rest again. Oh my gosh. Come on. Come on. It's a pincer. Why is this taking me so long? That even ominous wind didn't do that much. Thank you. Go away. Shoo. Shoo. Alright. I am not I'm not on board with uh Bridget right now. Hold on. I'm gonna try and avoid trainers. Just for right now, I'm gonna try and avoid them. I, I will come back and battle them. I'm not going until he moves. Okay, thank you. Alright. Oh, it was a Venonat! Okay, so my encounter out here was definitely a Venonat last time. And uh, we were unable to... I took one step. I took one step. Like, this is why the speed up button is turned on right now. Even though I'm sure it's going to wind up causing me to... Wait. There's a static encounter, or there might even be two static encounters out here somewhere. Alright, are you permanently looking that way? I guess so. Once I get another encounter, I will come back and battle these guys. But I'm pretty sure our Pokemon are supposed to be like level 27. Uh, is the highest that I wanted them to be. I found Hydro Pump. Okay, that's, that's quite a move. But it's one of those... It's probably going to miss just because it's me and my bad luck. So I don't know if I want to teach it to anybody. Also, I kind of want to save it for a water type, and I'm about to throw up a repel. I've spent money on repels, so I might as well, I think what I'm gonna do is I'm going to use the repels instead of the speed up button. Okay. So now, actually it's this way. I shouldn't run into another, wait a minute. Oh my God. Gosh! That was annoying. These trainers... Did I start running? I might have started running past him. So that might be why he turned around. But Alright, let's take these guys out real quick. V-Create. Okay, we got a V-Create bag on here. Okay. Can I get a bag on? Can I get something? Can I get something? My team right now is con consists of a Nine Tails that has no moves, a Magmortar, and a Porygon Two. Like, can I? There are so many cool Pokemon that are available. Can I please have another encounter? I'm asking nicely, please. Please, game, give me something. Okay, let's go this way. I feel like there's supposed to be static encounters here. Or, you know, potential static encounters. I don't remember how to trigger them. Also, I forgot to turn the speed up button off. All right. No, wait! You know, I was just thinking about the the nurse on the route coming up um, that heals. And also, I still have a nurse back uh, by Pinwheel Forest that I never spoke to. Um, wait, wait, don't turn. Thank you. I'm going to have to go back and battle all of these guys. 
all of them. But my first priority is to get over to the the other part of the desert. Oh, he looked right at me. Okay, ah, I made it out. Ah, ah, ah. Okay, he's a dig pro, and he gave me dragon breath. Gave me dragon breath. I could use that. Alright, hold on. Let me think. 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 Let's take a look at our bag. Because I need to give Bridget some better moves. And, you know, I could like. I could look and see if Bridget could learn dragon breath. No. Superpower, Shadow Punch. Shadow Punch never misses? Since when? I didn't know that. I have Arrow Blast. Like... I really don't have a lot of good TMs. Which is weird. Haven't had the best of luck. Alright. Now let's see if I can make it through one more- Oh, Desert Resort. I think, let me know if you're against this. I might do an inside and an outside desert resort, kind of like I did with Pinwheel Forest. It doesn't matter. I'm going to wind up killing the Pokemon anyway. So, I mean, does it really matter? Does it really matter? Actually, you know what I might do? I might let Katita lead because Katita won't take Sandstorm damage. So let's see what our encounter is going to be here. Our encounter in the desert resort is... Wow. All right. It's an Illumise. One of my least favorite Pokemon. You know what? For the sake of the lock, I will throw a ball. Will you stay? Please, Illumise. I rhymed for you. Come on, is that enough? That should be enough for you. You're an Illumise. That's not enough for you. Come on, Illumise. You're just an Illumise. Oh, and insulting you didn't work either. Whoa, you have Focus Blast. Hold on. Hold on. I'm gonna switch to Emery, because Focus Blast... Okay, Focus Blast literally did nothing. Um, if I need to, I can Swift? But I'm going to try a couple more Pokeballs first before I get to that desperateness. There we go! Alright! Hold on, let me, before I do what I'm doing, let me slow the game back down. Uh, B... What was it? What is it? Alright, here we go. First name only, feminine. Generate a name. Alright, we have caught Illumise! Firefly Pokemon, water type. With its sweet aroma, it guides Volpe to draw signs with light in the night sky. Sure. Give a nickname. These names always wind up fitting. I don't know why. They always wind up fitting. Like, look at this. What? We have Andrea. The Illumise. Let me check out Andrea the Illumise. A water type, bashful nature, with focus, oh god. With cloud nine, with slash, focus blast, fury swipes, and endeavor. Do I have any? I do have a water type move. 
But you're gonna have to prove yourself if you want if you want that. If you want me to give you hydro pump, can you learn it? Can you learn it? You can't learn it. Emery can learn it. Might give it to Emery. Emery's proven himself. Alright. Well, Andrea. I don't have a lucky egg, do I? What's the item I have? I have a quick claw. Uh, okay. Now, I'm gonna use Andrea to catch our next encounter. Please don't battle me. Thank you. Awesome. So, that was our Desert Resort outside encounter. Now, I'm gonna run through here. And do a Desert Resort inside encounter. And the only reason I'm doing this is because we have had no luck with encounters. And speaking of no luck with encounters, we find a Spiro. Alright. Sandstorm is up, but that's okay. I've got Cloud 9. Let's get rid of that stuff. He has Drizzle, so that means I'm faster than he is. But it's, it's raining. That doesn't really matter. I'm going to use... We're both to level 20, so let's slash him. Not very effective. I might just throw another ball, honestly. Okay, I see you. I see you out here, Andrea. Okay, is your only move Nightmare? Is your only move Nightmare? Awesome. This is good. I, I like that we are finally adding on to the team. Um, whoa! We have Spiro the Electric Steel type. It flaps its small wings busily to fly. Using its beak, it searches in grass for prey. Yes, give a nickname. His name will be... I've never heard of this name before. I don't know if it fits. Like... What, is it, what does this name mean? What is this name from? This website is all about, like, what names are about and, like, learning where names come from. But I don't think... Hold on. Yeah, it doesn't, like... I can't just click on the name Bitor and see where... See who and what and all that stuff. So let's check out our Bitor. Bitor, as we said, electric steel, timid nature... As long as he winds up being a, spe a special attacking Pokemon, it's not bad. He has a he has Nightmare. Wait. Oh, he's not asleep. That was I'm dumb. Anyway, he has Acid, Nightmare, U-Turn, and Bind. What is up with our Pokemon and the move Acid? Okay. Now that I have two encounters, let's run back. And start taking on some of these other trainers. Now, uh, you know what? There's one more encounter. Let's go ahead and get it. Um, there's one more. Let's see if I can avoid all of the trainers. Let's see if I can avoid all the trainers through here. I will come back. Don't worry. Next episode, speed up button is going to stay on. I found two gems back to back. Whoa. Well, I think these are both the same place. Relic Castle. Let me check. Are these both Relic Castle? I think these are both Relic Castle. Yes. Okay. I'm going to let our encounter be... I don't have a choice. It is a... Weavile! Okay. That one I'm very happy about. I'm very happy about this one. Very happy about this one. Avalanche? What type am I? I already forgot. Water. I'm water type. How does Weavile 
randomized get a get avalanche all right i don't want to slash again because i know my team and i know that andrea will crit 100 percent, i know andrea will crit here so i'm just going to throw the great ball and we're just going to let it happen because it's a weavile yes okay i'm happy uh uh wait Oh, I don't know if I was on the right setting. All right, cool. So we have Weavile. We have the Sharp Claw Pokemon, Dragon Water type. Evolution made it even more devious. It communicates by clawing signs and boulders. I like it. Uh, the name... I named my Weavile's Fruit Punch. Uh, it was actually a name given to me by somebody. Uh, but I really like it. We have Hammond, our Weavile. Let's take a look at Hammond. We have a team of six. Dragon Water, Naive Nature, which is not bad. He is a special attacking. Oh, he has Synchro. Oh my god! Hey, whoa, 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 calm down. Bone Rush, Zap Cannon, Blue Flare, and Avalanche. Calm down. Now, before I do anything, if he can learn Dragon Breath, the game is over. Oh! That's so sad. Alright, what else? What else? Actually, I think... We added Andrea, Bitor, and Hammond. I like it. Here's what I'm going to do. To end our episode, I'm going to run back to the Pokemon Center. Oh, I thought I thought it was locking me in some story or something. I am finding all kinds of stuff that I wish I wasn't finding. All right. We're gonna run back. We're gonna heal. I could have found a spirit tomb. I'm not a huge spirit tomb fan. I don't know if anybody is a spirit tomb fan. What? Oh no! <laughs> I can't even get upset. I can't even be upset. I can't even be upset. I can't even be upset. I seriously can't be upset. Because what did I expect? Ah! Stop! Okay. The game was sped up. I couldn't do anything about this. Hold on. Why did I slow it back down? He has a Rayquaza. Is this how we're going to end the episode? Is this really how things are going to go down? Okay. I'm going to use Protect. Let me just scout real quick. X Scissor. Okay, I'm a Fire type. Let me just see how much this... Okay. Okay. Katita, let's go. Let's go, Katita. Heal block. I don't know if that really matters. Whoa, that did nothing. All right, hold on. I'm going to use Lava Plume. He is cosmic powering all the way up. Just gonna whirlwind them away. I don't feel like dealing with that. I don't feel like dealing with all that. You know what I'm saying? No! No! Well, I guess you use workup. 
I don't know why my controller does this! It's so annoying! Uh. Why did I go back to using Vacuum Wave? When Lava Plume obviously did more. Weather Ball? Yeah, okay. Alright, goodbye Rayquaza. That was a little crazy. About to send out Seedra. I'll stay in, whatever. Starting after I heal, <laughs> I'm not going to be using anything except uh, our two new guys. I would say our three new guys, but one of them kind of died. Like a dummy. What? I'm not upset about losing Illumise for two reasons. One, I don't like Illumise. It's one of my least favorite Pokemon. You know, and I don't even remember if it's for the right reason. Because what I remember is that it was either Illumise or Volbeat that killed our, uh, that killed Sonom, our Latios, in our Emerald game. And also, like, Illumise and Volbeat, they're just terrible Pokemon. Like, they're just terrible Pokemon in general. Um, but also... It was water type, and we just picked up Weavile, Hammond, who is dragon water. So, I mean, what a, wait, I don't think I have any weaknesses. What weaknesses would I have? Because, I mean, I guess I'm weak to dragon, but like, Wait, 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 wait. I guess I'm weak to dragon. But I wouldn't be weak to electric because dragon resists electric. I wouldn't be weak to grass because dragon resists grass. I wouldn't be weak to ice because water resists ice. Alright, Illumise, it was fun. You had Focus Blast. I was actually kind of looking forward to trying out this Focus Blast thing, but you, you, you didn't make it because you were too slow. What was your speed stat anyway? 32? What? I don't know what a good speed stat looks like right now. Hold on. Let me look. What are our speeds looking like? 50, 53, 73, 22, 42. So 50 it was, or did I say 50? Or did I say 30? Wait, hold on. What did I say? What was your speed? 32. I guess that, I guess that was pretty low, but. All right, I'm going to heal. And then in the next episode, which will be up tomorrow, um, we're going to be using Hammond and... Bittor. We're going to be using Hammond and Bittor in the next episode. Trying to... We're going to try to solely use them. Okay. Uh, I'm going to do everything I can to try and keep them alive because Lord knows I'm not the best at keeping things alive. Okay? I'm, I'm, ju I'm just not, alright? How much? Uh, that's fine. How many Great Balls do I have? I'm going to buy one of these. I'm going to buy four of these because we do still have more encounters coming up in the relative future. But we've got to get through the desert first. And then we get to do, like, the route to the right of Nimbasa, to the left of Nimbasa. So we'll get two more encounters before our next gym battle. Which means hopefully we'll have a team full of um, 25s-ish. 25, 26, 27-ish. Because, um, again, I, I don't want to go over 27. So I'm not going to be using, if I can, I'm not going to be using our three elite members. 
Uh, and actually, I have to box, per my rules, I need to box Katita because Katita is 29. Um, so I'm actually going to save here, which is only like 10 steps north of where we saved last episode. So you can see the progress that we made. But anyway, we actually did make some progress. Adding members to our team is a big, big deal. Especially to get something like Weavile, who is one of my favorite Pokemon. Uh, he's not as high as he used to be. Um, because I've stopped playing Pokémon, he has come down just a little bit. But anyway, we're going to wrap up the episode right there. If you enjoyed today's White Domination, make sure you hit the thumbs up down below. Make sure you subscribe with the little bell icon click, because we're back from our vacation. Uh, our real life vi vi uh, vacation. We'll be taking another vacation in a game very shortly. Again, thank you so much for spending some time with us. We'll see you in the next episode. Until then, spread some positivity, be the light, and have a blessed day.